totally at night. All right, we're outside the, um, well, close to the Oscar Wilde, where we're playing tonight. It's in the ground floor of that building behind me, massive building. Uh, it's got a taxi once again. We've been taxiing a lot here. Um, it's dark night, isn't it? Second, it's like an office office complex. All the big buildings around here, and this here is Oscar Wilde, where we're going to be playing tonight. Our second time here, we played in their sister pub already twice. And it's the last show we do for these guys, and then we're. Uh, to Molly's after that. Yeah. You're going with this it's open Ori. from Tel Aviv? Yeah. <laughs> it's Ori. He's responsible of the sound. It's gonna be good tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Who wants to take a picture with you? With me, yeah. They're on their way. That's great. I love Israel. <laughs> Just as entertaining fans. Let's go and check it out. Surprise them. Talking to the fans. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> my new best friends. <laughs> Crazy people. Stephen? Yes, yes. Oscar Wilde done. Oscar Wilde, four nights of Oscar Wilde. How was it for you? It was good. Last two nights were fantastic. Um, great crowd. Yeah. Um, Des? What? Anything to ask them? It was a wild night. <laughs> Stole some of their posters, I feel quite guilty. I don't think they're going to need them tomorrow. No, the honour. Good morning. I'm on my way to um, Molly Blooms, where we play our first show in Molly's. Tonight, we got four four shows there. Um, just back, went for a run, but I got it done. It was week the first uh, run of the week five on the 5k running up, 5k runner up. Uh, it's getting tough, but uh, in a way, it felt easier than the beginning of week four. Um, so, whew, it, it, that app really works. If you, if you ever had wanted to get into running and struggled, that app really, really works. Can't recommend it highly enough. Um, so, quick, quick shower now. I'm on my way to Molly's where I have a sound check there. This early sound check due to um, some football on in the afternoon, so they want, want us to do it early, which is fine by me. Take a green light wherever it comes first. <laughs> These crossroads. No matter what 
what I tell myself. God. For the first few years we were coming to Tel Aviv, uh, we stayed in uh, Gordon Inn. Um, Robert used to own it. It was a uh, great, uh, great hostel with a great bar downstairs. But uh, we've gone up in the world to have an apartment now. <laughs> No regard for my help It's later than I thought again I must have missed my bus I tried to hold on to the band But the road keeps slipping on That I won't blame you. So I'm checking in Molly's setting up, really, this day. Um, it's a small spot, it ain't Carnegie Hall, but it'll do. It's this stage to play here so much that it feels like a home away from home. Looking forward to it. I know what I put you through. No words left to say. Day I do my best to make it through Without your love I don't know what Check out those lads. I'm just about to head to um, Molly Bloom's where we're playing tonight. Uh, before I do, I want to show you this Tel Aviv skyline at night. Now I need some coffee. That was the first gig. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. What did you say we look like? What, what did you What did you say we look like? Not much. Uh, you look like fa grand grandfather. <laughs> who is who? <laughs> this is going south very fast. <laughs> father and son. No, grandfa father and son. No, you're the father and no. son. Grandpa. <laughs> Because it's, uh, it's a good sign. How was it? Uh, first night in Molly Blooms, it was great. Very good, except for the dancing man. How was the gig? The gig was great. Oh, sorry, sorry. I thought I asked for it. <laughs> no, it was actually, according to Robert, it was, it was, fun. It was grand. 
It was grand. Grand is good. Grand. Grand is good. It's, it begins with a G oh, yeah, as well. <laughs> Like a headbanger's ball tonight? I'm not, I'm not one who said, wow, well, that's fantastic. Oh, I took it out. Right. Oh, you look that's really nice or good. Yeah, but when I'm playing whistle, the hair goes in my mouth, so. Ah, yeah, so that's why you like the uh, All right, okay. Uh, first gig in Molly's done. It's great. It's good fun. I have a takeaway. I'm going go back to the gaff and eat and relax. Um, I just want to share you with a quick story of something that happened tonight. <laughs> Middle of the gig, this random person I never met before walks, and I'm literally talking to a microphone at this stage. And I have the microphone here, I'm talking to it, and the guy stands right behind it, staring me in the eyes, and all the audience behind him, and he says, I'm a rapper. I want to rap. I want to make it happen. I'm going to fight. Which, first, I thought I was a bit worried, <laughs> but <laughs> but uh, I did understand kind of that he didn't mean that he wants to actually physically fight me. He just wants to make a big point that he wants to rap. And. Uh, you know, I'm in the middle of a gig, I'm trying to do my job. So I said, no, it's not going to happen. Simple as that, you know. There's a crowd of people behind you who's actually here to listen to us. Uh, and there's a manager, an owner there who brought us over here to play the music. So, no, it's not going to happen. And uh, then he said to me, that would it make a difference if I told you Jim Morris talked to me in a dream. Seriously, I'm not making this up. This is what he said to me. <laughs> the very random thing, and he was very insistent and kind of walking in the middle of a gate right in front of you. Like... Weird. Anyway, just want to share that with you.